This is how you turn off core parking in Windows 10. The first thing you're going to do is go to Reg Edit and open it. You're going to go under H key local machines, so just click on that. Now you're going to go under Edit to Find. And you're going to paste the key I put in the information section of this video. So you can right click and paste that in there, or you can Control V, either one works. You're going to search only by keys. So you only want keys check marked. Find next. This takes a few seconds. And there you go. You're now under the power management in the registry. Whatever change you make here will save through a reboot. The only time it will change is a big update like the creator's update. So under value max, you're going to double click this, the one that's set to 64. And you're going to change 64 to 0. Okay, done. Windows core parking is now off until Windows fucks it up again with a big update. Um, when they do that, it's going to be easy to fix because the last place you were in in RegEdit is still going to be there. So you're just going to type in RegEdit again. Value max will be 64 again. And you're just going to set that to zero. That's it. You don't need any third-party bullshit. Uh, you don't have to worry about viruses. None of that crap. Windows should make this available, but Windows, Microsoft's retarded. Um, core parking is absolute dog shit. It's only good for laptops and batteries. It's never been good. Um, this really makes a difference if you have an i7, like I do, or an FX chip, or the new AMD Ryzen. You want this shit off. Just turn it off. It sucks. Alright, hope it helps. Later.